Gas is crazy expensive right now, and I've been looking for different ways to save on gas for my family. I had heard about the Upside app to get cash back on gas and other shopping. I tried it out for myself, and I'm gonna give you all the pros and cons of the Upside app. So first up, you have to get the app and sign up for an account. When you're signing up, you can enter a referral code as your promo code to get an extra bonus when you sign up. If you don't have a friend referring you, I would love to be your friend and refer you, so I'm gonna include my code down below if you wanna use it. After you signed up, the next thing you're gonna need to do is add some debit or credit cards to your account. To add a card, you go to menu, my wallet, and then add a card. Now you're not entering your full card number. You're only entering the first few digits and the last few digits. And this is how the Upside app matches your transaction to your account. Next up is to find an offer near you. And you'll notice that the offers vary a lot. Even the same brand of gas station, one station's gonna offer a totally different deal than another one. When you find an offer that you like, you'll click claim the offer, and then you have four hours to go and use it. You'll notice that some of the offers have a little blue lightning symbol next to them, and and some don't. If they have the blue lightning symbol, that means that you can use the check-in option for that offer. And if they don't, that means that you're gonna have to take a picture of your receipt. If you are using one of those check-in offers, when you get to the gas station, you need to go into the app and click check-in. And then it'll ask you which card you're gonna use to buy your gas. And that's where you're gonna choose that card from your wallet. After you've checked in, you have 20 minutes to complete your transaction. If you used an offer that did not have the check-in option, you will have to take a picture of your full receipt and upload it in the app. After two to four days, you should get your cash back in your account. Then you have that cash back amount building up in your Upside account. But one of the nice things about the Upside app is that you can cash it out with as little as $1. You'll see that you can cash it out for various gift cards and they start at $10, but you can transfer the cash back into your bank account with as little as $1. All right, so that's how the Upside app works. Let's talk about some of the pros and cons. One pro is that there seem to be offers pretty much everywhere. Even in small little towns, wherever you are, you're probably gonna find a cash back gas offer. Another benefit is that you can use the Upside app together with a cash back credit card that has a gas bonus. For example, I like to use my cost Visa that has a 3% cashback bonus on gas. And I can use that together with the Upside app. Another benefit I already mentioned is that you can cash out with as little as $1. I also like that you can get actual cash back into your bank account and you don't have to get gift cards. Another benefit is that you can refer your friends and family and you'll get a little bit of cash back every time they use the app as well. So let's talk about some of the negatives of the Upside app. The first is that the gas deals that you're getting in the app are generally not gonna be as good as what you could get if you went to a discount gas station, especially the wholesale clubs. And the day I was looking at this recently, the best deal I could find in the Upside app was $4.66 for gas, but Costco was only $4.30 the same day. Another downside is that the deals for cash back vary a lot based on the profit of the particular gas station. So as their wholesale prices for gas go up and down, the amount of cash back they're offering you is going to vary a lot. And sometimes the cash back is only one cent per gallon. Another downside is that the cash Cashback amounts can be reduced if you're using another discount program, like a loyalty program to that particular gas station. From the options I've looked at for saving on gas, I still think your number one choice is to use a wholesale club gas station like Costco or Sam's Club and to do it with a credit card that has a cashback bonus on gas. But I would say your second best option is to use the Upside app together with a credit card with a cashback bonus on gas. If you don't have access to a credit card with a cashback bonus, I think your third best option is the Upside app together with the Pay With Gas Buddy card. And I have a separate video about the Pay With Gas Buddy card and how that works. In my family, I personally buy most of my gas at Costco with my Costco credit card. But for my husband, that's not convenient on his commute to work. So he uses the Upside app together with a Costco credit card with cash back on gas. If you have ideas on how to save on gas, I would love to hear about it in the comments below. We all could use some more ideas on how to save on gas right now.